geography czar here with some post shoot analysis. I did a comparison shoot with some um, 22 Magnum gold dots in the North American Arms Black Widow you see here, and some 380 gold dots in the Ruger LCP you see here. I cut into the block right at 10 inches. I did a bare gel shot burst with the 22. We fired a single 22 Magnum round into the bear gel, and it stopped at 10 inches. And two of the Gold Hot 380s stopped at 10 inches in the subsequent denim test that I did. These 10 bullets right here were fired through three layers each of heavy denim, all exhibit expansion and all penetrated to no less than 10 inches. Surprisingly, the 22 Magnums appear to have penetrated a little bit deeper. You can also see my calibration BBs in the background there. Uh, the first BB was a little slow, about a 520, but the second calibration BB was within spec and penetrated three and three eighths inches in case you're curious. The block was 39 degrees Fahrenheit at the time in case you're curious. And when I did my shoot, it was a little bit cooler than that, having been packed on ice from that refrigerator all the way out to the test, which was done in temperatures in the low 40s. Here are the bullets I dug out of the gel. They are gorgeous. Considering those rounds passed through three layers of 13 ounce denim before reaching 10, 11, or in the case of the 22, up to 12, or one with 12 and a quarter inches into the gel block, and that's a good firm gel block, one of the best I've ever made, I would say with either one of these weapons, you would be armed. I don't know if you'd say well armed, getting 10 or 11 inches penetration, or in the case of the Magnums, 11 to 12 with, uh, well, they expanded, <laughs> but they're 22 caliber. Um, yeah, you, you'd be well armed with either one of these. I am just absolutely impressed.